Whoa, hold on. Before you guys watch this episode, just so you know, I see the purple parrots walked out, so I instead gave Lucas of the Silver Snakes a chance to compete for the temple. Thank you. Enjoy. All right, welcome back to Legends. As you can see, we don't have the same contestants because, unfortunately, Icy decided to just leave. I don't know why. So now it's going to be Christian of the Orange Iguanas versus my boy, Lucas Priest of my Silver Snakes. And Temple Game number one, as you've seen before, it's Capture the Flag. One must get the American flag, and the other must get the Confederate flag. First team that returns their flag within 60 seconds, or the team that's furthest along for the 60 seconds wins. On your marks, get set, go! And they're off, both coming oh, down the ramp. Chris is having a little trouble. Time's going down. Hey, at least this time I didn't Over bring it. Jack, you better give me some support, because I'm already losing. And I mean... All right. <laughs> 40 seconds on the clock. They're both going for the flags. Christian's uh, trying to get the flag. Lucas is going for the flag. He's got it. He's got to turn the boat around. Oh, Christian just retrieved the, the flag. Mine went behind the flag. Are you serious? You got to go get it. Hurry up. I can no, screw it. I'm giving him the win. 21 seconds, 19. Screw this. Lucas is heading back with the Confederate flag. Screw this. And it. place it down. Hoorah! Lucas wins. Screw this. Silver Snakes have half a pendant. <laughs> Moving on to the next game. I All right, for Temple game number two, as you recall, it's the Head Retriever. They must grab one head at a time and bring it back down and place it on the podium within 60 seconds. The team that places the most heads or the team that gets all their heads down within 60 seconds wins. Also, keynote, it must be placed before time is up or it won't count. You got it? Oh. Yes? Okay, okay. On your marks. Yep. Got it. Get set. Go! All right, they're heading up. This is for another half pen. It's Sil Silver Snakes oh. currently have the lead. They're going for one head. Lucas is coming down. He's going to place it. All Wait, right. Place it on the right podium. All right, they're tied up. 40 seconds on the clock. They're going for another head. Christian grabs a head. They're both going down. All right, they got to place it. Here we go. Sorry if I'm saying all right a lot, but I can't help it. So they both are tied. It's okay. No. We have 22 seconds. Now 20. Oh, Christian's coming down. Come on, Lucas, speed it up. 15 seconds. Go, go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Time up. Got Oh, man. Did you get that head on in time? I don't think serious? you did. Which head did you have, Lucas? Ah, uh, uh, man, let's see. I think they're tied. Let me make sure they're all wait, correct. So what that means we're tied. Yep. So they tied. They both get the pendant. All right, Temple game number three, the Emerald Retriever. Each team must push that <laughs> button right on top of their ceiling to grab the Emeralds. And they can press it as many times as they want, and they must throw the emeralds into the hoppers to get it to the other side in their chest. The first team that gets the most emeralds in their chest will win the full pendant and get to the temple. On your marks! Get set! Go! All right. They're moving fast. This is going to be anybody's game. As of right now, between both the teams... Uh, Orange Iguanas have half a pendant, and um, Silver Snakes have a full pendant because they won the first game. And since they tied, that gets both of them in there. Back. 35 seconds left. Still anybody's game. They're both trying to work as hard as they can to get all those emeralds in there before time is up. It doesn't matter, though. Because <laughs> once time is up, they have to stop. 20 seconds. Fifteen, fourteen, thirteen, twelve, eleven, ten. 
10 seconds. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. Stop. Time is up. Let's see how they did. All right, uh, orange iguanas, 21. Silver snakes, 21. They're tied, oh. which means we must have a tiebreaker to the steps of knowledge. All right, we're back at the steps of knowledge for the tiebreaker. All comes down to this. Whoever gets the correct answer moves to the temple. They both have a pendant and a half. So, whoever gets this correct answer moves on. And here's the question. What effect does the jump scare of the Elder Guardian give you? Christian. Mind decay. Incorrect. What? Lucas. Mining, mining fatigue. Correct! Yes. You're moving to the temple! Congratulations, Lucas! We'll see if he makes it through right after this!